song. So, uh, sorry to everyone who's showing up late. Like, they need to play Daylight. Come on. Uh, but you guys got it, and that's the special. You guys fucking got it. Well, let me just say, so Kim, not only is this like, we're just trying this thing. We've never done like an album show before, but this album meant a fuck ton to us, and hopefully it meant something to some of you. And again, the is only 28 minutes long, and we're not just gonna leave after that. We're gonna bring the heat after it. Let me tell you, I want a motherfucking party. A motherfucking party is motherfucking mosh pits. <laughs> you guys are gonna see my motherfucking itty bitty titties. Some of y'all who want to shake that ass, okay? You want to shake that ass? You are my cheerleaders. I give you permission, and everyone will be civil, but just to kindly push your way front and center. I need you on this. We're going to step it up. Kim, are you ready?
you, Kim. Um, so, Kim, I think this is where you got to show them a little what you want to do here. So here's the thing. Kim was saying, I want to try to do this thing. When we were recording this album, we were in our apartment on Grand Street. It was me, Kim, my brother, and our friend in my bedroom. Stop, clap, stop, clap. Our okay, okay, yes, our bedroom. Any bedroom where we bed together, that's our bedroom, okay. Um, one quick second. Uh, why this camera thing is happening here is when we came up, we used to play like in warehouses and art spaces and we played on the floor. And the audience was all the way around us and we just wanted to keep you behind us for this whole section. We just wanted The whole room. So Kim, okay, okay. First, let me say I have figured out that if you can do this, you are amazing in bed. So make sure you look around to see who can do it, because that's who you're gonna fuck tonight. But okay, it's simple. All it is, wait, I gotta put this mic somewhere. Hang on. Okay. Uh, uh, Kim, I've tried you talking to my dick before too. <laughs> Okay, this is a song called Scare Chain. Do you, do you want to put that down?
Though I won't do it, do it, play if you want, do it I'm the young CEO, sure, get it, yeah, yeah The first nigga to have my body in there I just check my balance, I probably pull up in your hood and come by me in there, no cap You know that your hoe told you that nigga crazy, I'm thinking she lied to you, nigga Yeah, get caught with your hoe in the park, and you better not have to stop by me, nigga Like I don't know, but fuck it, I'm obviously winning Don't make me go with the bank, take out a hundred to show you how far it's a dip I'm out with your bitch, and I only want knowledge, she got a little knowledge, I'm chillin' this one, can we turn this thing up to like, can turn it up to like 80 and a half? Um, we, we tried this last night, I don't know if it was good or bad, but we put together a slideshow presentation, a PowerPoint presentation from the making of the album Grand. Two questions. A, should we not do it? Cheer. Do it! You people are like, don't do that shit. Do you want to see our PowerPoint? Okay? Okay. Let me, let me bring up our first picture here. So, what he has here, this is where I grew up in Vermont. I graduated from public school with 17 people in my grade. Okay? No one lived there. Motherfucking 17 people. Like, I had already fucked 17 people by the time. That's not a lie, okay? Um, so, but here is where we did our first month or two of recording. Two months. Two months. Two months. In my childhood bedroom, on the upstairs floor in January of this house, um, where there is no heat. Okay, so let's let's look the other direction here. Um, there is nothing there. Nothing. Kim was terrified she was going to get killed. No, let me tell you guys. This is the type of place that, like, you happen to go outside at night and some motherfucker kills you, skins you, and then wears your skin because he's pretending to be you. This is the shit that happens in the nowhere. Look at him right here. I gave that haircut, not bad, right? Uh, okay, let's see what else we got here. There's me. Um, okay, this this is still my parents had not changed my bedroom in the years I had been gone. It was just covered in records, shag carpeting, and there is some stuffed animals. Don't look too closely. Okay. Uh, you want to point out some things okay. on my wall? This is, this is like one of the walls in the room. Okay. So we have a poster 
the natural bond killers. <laughs> Next to train spotting. Wait, wait, let me just say, I could not afford posters. These were cut out for magazines, okay? <laughs> hey, you guys remember magazines before the internet? <laughs> Chasing Amy. I like to keep it a little sweet. Kevin yeah. Smith is chill. Oh, look at Kevin. <laughs> She was that tasty. <laughs> this is me. I'm holding a progress board. Clearly, we have not made much progress. We saw this on a Blink-182 documentary called the Eureka Chronicles. Shit, they do a progress board. We should do a progress board. Matt looks so happy, but we had gotten little done. This is like first week. And by the time all those stickers were on, I was crying. Okay. Uh, there's me again. In the back, if you see the California Raisins poster, I remember when... Okay, so when we show you other 80s babies out there, remember the California Raisins. So I remember going to my cousin's house when I was like eight or nine, and they asked me, what's your favorite band? And I told them, you know that song, Heard It Through the Grapevine by the California Raisins? And they still mock me to this day, okay? You want to see what is happening? Again, we're in the fucking middle of nowhere. So you want to know what happens? Fuck, what is it? Is it a, it's not a squirrel. What's it called? Um, it was a squirrel. Or a chip, chipmunk. It was a, yeah. it was a squirrel. One or the other. A fucking rodent comes into the house and leaves us seeds at night. This was on top of an amplifier. All right. Jim, we're losing them. We gotta keep it moving. This is me just blowing my nose because I don't actually have a nasally voice. I'm just constantly congested. Okay, you know how it is. Uh, and that's the entire presentation. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Fuck the game, right? This is a song called One time, who is the professional fighter? Ronda Rousey said this was her fucking okay. fight song. I saw an interview. Let's go!
This next song, which is the last song on the album of Green, we played for our first time last night and we fucked it up pretty good. But Tim, I feel like this Pittsburgh energy is gonna just live this thing. Because I'm gonna start this song, Tim's gonna start with the drums. I'm gonna yell, one, two, three, jump. And anyone who does that for me, I will love from now to forever and forever. Come on, Tim.
faces on it. Right? Split it up. I need everyone on that side to take 10 motherfucking steps this way. Right? Split it up. I need everyone on that side to take 10 motherfucking steps this way. Right? Split it up. I need everyone on that side to take 10 motherfucking steps this way. Right? Split it up
fucking steps that way. We need to spread this shit wide. If you see someone walking out down the middle, crowd surf that motherfucker back. Okay, who is it? I need to get fair with all of If you want to get mixed up, come into the middle. Come out. And in that video, it's more positive. This is a wall of family love, man. This is a wall of death, okay? So, we're in the circle song. This is a new song of ours. And we can hear the words, go, go, go. I mean, some kid, make some noise right now. Like, Go. I want both sides to come together for a big dance party. So, let's do this thing. We're going to do something.
tour. We wanted to celebrate this. We didn't know how many people. You, this album's 10 years old, and you came and you're dancing. And you're all the same. I know. I know. Also, I know you paid for the show, and we keep asking for favors from you. But this is classic man kid. This involves hundreds of balloons we need to blow up here. Uh, so if you can do me a favor, blow these up, tie them up, and just hold on to them for a minute, okay? Uh, let's do something like this. Surprise motherfucker. Throw all those balloons up in the air. This song goes like this.
Okay, this next part of the show, this next song here. This, this is just about me getting over a deep fear I have of karaoke. Okay, I've had my worst performances of my life doing karaoke. Yeah. Worst performances ever. Like, ever. Something about karaoke and it just fucking bruises up. To the point that I'm yelling, get the fuck down, get down. It's bad. But this song is a song that came out, well, just today. It's a song called Money, okay? And it's about, it's about how money does not buy you happiness. It really does. If people can tell you it a million times, but me and Kim used to be broke as fuck. We used to be searching for change in our couch cushions in our practice days. And there were some of the fucking best times of my life until this, like, this part of my life. Okay, you know, it gets pretty good. But all the same, this song, I'm gonna try to do this. It goes like this. And I want you guys to sing with us too. We got you right here. You got this? Under pressure, Queen and David Bowie was the worst performance of my entire life, and there was only six people there. Yeah. But this song, this next song, um, if we turned this song, this show, up to 11, I think we did. We yes! did well done. Can we just get it to fucking 12 and a half right now? Come on, let's go.
got you for one second. I don't remember if we talked about this. Did y'all know Kim tore her ACL like yes. us? A matter of weeks ago. She has no ACL in this knee, it's just dangling. It's dangling like a leg tip. It's just in there fucking flashing around. Are you going to tonight? Are you going to say it? The doctor suggested you probably want to have the surgery, you probably shouldn't do this tour. And I said, fuck no! No, that's not happening. I'm doing this fucking tour because I need to fucking do this tour. I thank you for giving us this because after after this tour, it's going to be back to in the bed for a number of months. But uh, while we're alive right now, let's fucking take care of business. <laughs> who's just started this tour with us. Um, I'm just gonna say, last chance to do whatever the fuck you want. Yes, Let's do this. Thank <laughs> you.